Welcome, welcome everybody. Pursuit here. Hi, this is Phoenix. We are playing some RimWorld on Alpha 9 in our Rimton colony here together. And we noticed as we mm. left, Todd, Todd's busy here doing some sculpting. And why is he doing sculpting? Because he finished cleaning the base. <laughs> he, somebody else was cooking because he, he'll cook first, he'll clean, and then he'll go do some sculpting. So apparently... <laughs> That's a good sign that the base is doing well if he's there busy doing some sculpting. So, hey, okay. We'll let him enjoy himself and <sighs> see if we can get some good sculpting out of it. Probably not. It'll probably be lousy because he's only like a level three, but maybe it'll improve with time. And Komoro's doing research, it looks like. He is. I was thinking of Jay or Nuke doing it, but apparently he thought he could come do it too. So, burning the midnight oil, I'll tell you. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we're going to deconstruct this. Oh, right. Because we put the one over here, which we're going to add a build to. Yeah. Uh, smelt metal from slag. And we will just say... I think I'm just going to say do, for, do forever. Might as well. If somebody has no craft... If somebody wants to do some crafting and they're available, then... By all means, but yeah. They'll do that. Okay. We might have to change it if we get a whole bunch of metal in here, but I don't see that being a problem just yet. Oh, and we also put this to have um, these two spots here to have uh, steel slag also. We might change them to some kind of item that won't be moved, but... Now, if you remember from the last one, we were doing that to see if that would help neutralize the temperature so that it didn't get too hot in that <clears throat> central room. Because yeah, it's, it's... Yeah, it's... 33 right now, right. so... Right, it's... it's fairly toasty in there. And it's only 19 out here, so we could really use the heat to be pumped out. We thought yeah. about pumping it into the hydroponics, but... No, just be too much of a fluctuation. Yeah, I didn't want to mess with having issues. And look, I want, actually only one of these is running, and it's staying at 21 right now, so let's turn one of these off and keep an eye on, yeah. on this and just make sure that it stays. Because it's 22 in there right now. So... And they'll grow in fairly cool temperatures, so... Yeah, I think we should be okay. Oh, Todd stopped. He decided to go eat. Oh, we were also... He went over into that little mining corner. Uh, we were going to... We finally got the hops all saved up. So, we were going to try working on the brewery just a little bit. Oh, yeah. We're going to see if they won't finish clearing this out a little bit and do our brewing. Just for the sake of saying that we did. Because it's a new feature in the game, we want to kind of test it out. Marshall's um, still working on the same square. Let's tell Marshall to come work on this over here. <laughs> He's been working on that same block <laughs> for I don't know how many longs now. Now I'm not sure where best to put this. Um, I kind of see a few different spots here that need mined out. I'm going to tell him to stick around for a minute unless he's like... He gonna... needs to eat. Oh, uh, we'll let him eat. When he's done eating, we'll bring him back over. If he takes a long and all. Oh, he was going to anyway. Yes, yeah, so let's tell him to mine these though. Because I'm oh. thinking... Put it down below. Oh, envelope. Someone visiting. A group from the Green Plain people are visiting the colony. Hallelujah. Oh, goody goody. Okay. But I wasn't sure where we should put this. Like, um, I'm thinking How of putting it. it. It's it's your typical size thingy. Um, brewery. Okay. That's it's a of... it's a three spacer. So I'm thinking of putting it like right here because uh -huh. I don't know that we want to use this space down here yet if we really want to use it later we could always move it right but I don't see any need for it as soon as it clears out of way we can probably just pop it in here and have it working so okay. she's already moving this stuff out oh look let's see how it's doing they've got it open there oh. 27 22 so it actually is cooling it, it off. is doing a good job of that and they did put the metal slag there so apparently okay I feel like that would be more appropriate all right and they are just going to town on that mining. So let's there. pop this in here. The brewery. And we will be able to cook up some stuff here pretty quick. Alright. Keep them mining this stuff out because we could really use Why it. Why do we suddenly have wind blowing? This is lightning and thundering. Oh, it's a storm. Okay. Uh, sorry guys, you just kind of got stuck there. They're just hanging outside. You come in guys, come on in. I know. Apparently they don't want to. They like just stand out in the rain. We're great hosts. Oh look at that! It's in. Okay. And it does not need power either. Oh great! I don't have to deconstruct it. No. So let's go ahead and tell them 
We don't have a lot of hops, so let's just go ahead and tell them to do it forever and... And then if they want it, they can grow them. Yes. Is that all you need, is the hops? I think so. I think that's... Well, let's look. I didn't even look at the bill. I didn't think about it. It tells you all about it, so... 25. Small volume ingredients like gold acquired over it. What? Small volume like gold. 20 times as much. Well, okay. It requires 20. 25 hops, work amount of 17. I have no idea what that means. I have no oh, this is your basic telling you. Oh, all right. <laughs> this is not a small amount of ingredients. 20 I times think. the 20. You know, no, we don't need 20 times as much. Okay, gotcha. So, work amount of 17 required 25, and I don't know how much it produces. It probably produces like an eight pack of beer or something. <laughs> Great. I haven't actually made it before, so we'll see what it does. Um, so, yeah. Right. Let's do that then. Let's see what happens then. Oh, do, do you have a stockpile? Uh, that. they should put it in. Let's see where it puts it. I think you'll put it in here, though. Because this is all food, and I think it's technically considered a food. Yeah, you yep. put it in here. It did. Oh, and it did. It made a oh. little pack there. Todd's get, Todd just got Fine a beer, meal. I think. Oh, did he really? Yep, he's Todd's having a beer. <laughs> He's like, I'm me. in, man. I am in. <laughs> it's been a long time. <laughs> he is our bartender. He's like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> apparently he. It's also our drinker. He doesn't just work there. He drinks there too. Well, no um, comment. Well, it's supposed to increase your mood, also. So you slept in the heat. Oh wait, 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 wait. Why are why are they talking about being hot? It's very hot in that room, apparently. Still. Yeah, it's twenty. Two in here. It's 17. It's 14. So, the heat is not getting pumped out okay, entirely yet. Um, Do we need to have? But so, else? He's only hot though. He's not very hot, and he's also. I think he is. He's a cold. He's a cold lover, lover so he's going to be hot no matter what we do. Oh, if he wants okay. to cool off. He has to go hang out in the freezer. Great. The rest of them, I think, are okay though. We look at their thoughts. Oh, uh, they're hot. Uh, yeah. Well, he's he's, hungry, he's only hungry. He's sitting down. So. So, hot isn't a big deal. You got a five for hot, so... <laughs> they're all <laughs> in beers. They're all sitting around. Yeah, they're like, That's man, great. it's been a long time. <laughs> they, they're all gone. They're gone, just like that. <laughs> wow. Well, okay. <laughs> well, you know they like it. That's right. Walter likes it, too. She's going to make some more. That's funny. That is. That's, that's awesome. That's... I don't... Uh, the beer must be stuck on down here, though, yeah. because I don't... The hops is... I don't even know where the beer is... is uh, dun, 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 it's supposed to saying? be under... Foods? Up top? Raw meat. No. I don't is, know why... Is they're... meals included? Well, meals are... Is it, in the, is it in the meals, just for the sake of my wondering? Ha ha ha. Okay. Yep. Okay, so this has a higher priority, so they are going to put the food... Stuff in there. No, it's the same. I don't know why they put it down there rather than up here. Yeah, why not? He was, he was hiding it on the back shelf. Yeah. <laughs> he shoves it with the meat. Nobody's going to go in there. Oh, we can now make carpets. Awesome. We didn't know what we were going to do with our time, but apparently there's lots of things to do. What are we going to do when we've researched? Oh, no. Do we have colored lights? I forgot. I was thinking of colored carpets, which we just finished. I don't know. Um, we got colored lights, we got nutrient mortars. You know, I don't think we're going to build any of these right now, so let's just... Okay. Colored lights is as good as anything, I guess. Okay. Um, we're kind of just knocking off what's left at this point, because I don't think I'm going to build any mortars anytime soon either. Okay. We don't really have a base suited for mortars. Just out of curiosity, can you change from Phoebe to Cassandra? Yes, yeah. you can actually change. Okay. Just checking. Not that I'm really excited, but you have detected a cluster of cargo pods crashing nearby, but you can't read it. Perhaps you, perhaps <laughs> you'll find something useful in the wreck wreckage. <sighs> Ooh, meat. Is that, is that meat? Oh, um, human, human meat. meat. Um, we will let the animals eat that. That's just. We'll just leave that alone. That's just gross. Okay, whatever. The animals will eat anything you leave out there. This food. We'll let them dispose of it Enjoy that. themselves. Yeah. Oh, we got our final turret in, and we've got this down here going. Um, we're, doing, we're actually going low on power here. Yeah. 
Probably because we got some of these turrets on, and I have no way of turning them off. Why? Because they're not connected up to the same power as everything else. If I tell them to reconnect... Oh, that actually connected over there. That's good. You can't see it, but there's a little teeny wire there. Okay. Um, look at power. See, there's a little teeny wire. So that uh. one's good. This one is going to stay right there. This one... Maybe we can get this one to connect over there. Probably, because the other one did. Let's try that. Um, yep. Okay, so this one will be controlled with the same power. This one, um, we might just leave it on all the time, I guess. Just in One case. turret in there going all the time might not be a bad idea. Okay. Maybe. I don't have an easy way to turn it on and off. I mean, I think you can just turn it off. Like You if can you... designate toggle power right there. But... I forget how they're doing it now. Like... If I tell it to designate toggle power, somebody has to go in there and manually turn it off. Which right. means somebody will have to manually turn it on, too. Right. Which we might forget. True. But, let's see what happens. Maybe we'll remember. It may save the day if we have forgotten and it's the last one left and we have to turn it on. Yeah. Um, oh, that's no power, because there's no power. Um, I'm trying we... to see how much power we've got. we got 50 power coming in right now. Are we saving battery power? I guess we wouldn't be if we're... Well, we were going, again, we were going to build a... Oh, you know what? That's part of the problem. Is trees. It? We got trees out here. Not a lot of them, but... Locust isn't helping any. Locust? Yes, locust. Oh, I'm like, we have locust? <laughs> I didn't know there was locust in the game. Yes, we have a locust in the game. I don't think he's getting in the way. He's just hanging out there. These are all really low right now, but I think it's because of the windstorm. And then, oh, see, the same thing again. The windstorm kicks up and they don't work, so it's got to be something with that. That was just... I haven't read anything on it, but um, it just seems to be what happens. The wind kicks up when the power fails. Do you want to build have the other power? Do we want... Oh, oh, fire. That's why it started raining, because there's a fire down here out of control, I bet. Was there one on the other side, too? Oh, good grief. Well, forest fire, it's raining, though. It'll be put out pretty soon. Um, we really do need to consider putting in a different way of getting some power. Um, yeah. Which I considered. Um, that would be a good place. I think there's one Is down. there one down at the bottom, too? Here somewhere, wasn't no. there? No. Maybe I'm thinking of... There had been in another... Maybe. Yeah. So, you know what? We might just consider plopping one in there, or doing a different version of power. I mean, we have... Oh, we have other versions. We could do solar power also. Oh. Um, I'm not sure where we, we would put it. Um, and well, we could just plop it along here or something. Up top, maybe, above the generator. But it would go out during a windstorm, too. Like, over above the generator? That yeah, I'm worried about there. causing a fire here and not being able to get um, to it. Like, solar panels like to get destroyed by fire really easy. So it would need to be somewhere that we could get to them fast. But I'm thinking the generator is the best... Mm -hmm. Sometimes you can find one inside a mountain, which would be awesome. Um, There's a lot of mountain there. <laughs> yeah. I think we should just plan on putting one in here. Worst case, we have some excess power. I think I need to mine that one away. Let's go ahead and get started doing one. I mean... Here's an idea. It's something to do, you know? <laughs> um, yeah, we'll need to mine that little piece away right there. Mm -hmm. And we'll just tell them to, you yeah, know, when they're done with that, we'll plop it in there and let them start working on it. There you go. Which means we'd probably have to move this, because I don't, I think I want to run the power like this. Storm. And then over. How tall are those wind generators, anyway? <laughs> they're just these big, um, electro... <laughs> I don't think it actually does it say how big they are. I don't know. Let's see. Are they grounded? <laughs> it, they're they're obviously close enough that a tree affects them. Sure. Um, they are minus on the beauty apparently. That's okay. I was just curious here. Is how's his? Still got some work left to do and on it. Also considering putting some plants. To beautify the place, make them a little less grumpy. Oh yeah. A common area. 
I was thinking of plants and I was thinking of sculptures too, but we don't have any sculptures yet, so maybe we should put some plants in. Yeah, he's still working on that. Yeah, it's gonna be a while before he finishes that, so let's... Wood should probably be fine, we got lots of wood. Like, probably right here. Sure. Yeah, right here, and here? Okay. I don't know they're standing around here, maybe, or they're walking by. They might notice it and get a little bit of joy. Joy from the beauty of the plants. They tend to like that stuff. Do they actually take care of them, or does it just naturally take care of itself? No, they have to take care of them. Okay. It not take that much effort, though. They got the pots out there. Do they have to actually plant them, or do they just start? We can actually tell them what to plant, too, I think. What would you oh, rather have? Goodness. A daylily or a rose? You can do one of each. Put a rose over here. Okay. A daylily and a rose. We'll see what they do, and if we like them, we'll try it again. It's funny that they don't think that the garden area is a pretty little well place to be. But. What's interesting to me is that nobody's hauling this stuff. Oh, look, some more beer. Oh, yeah. Looks like they make them in five packs. Oh, Harry, don't, don't make a mess on the medicine. Are you kidding? Oh, why is he... Vomiting. He's in the kitchen vomiting. Why did he get food poisoning? How did he get food poisoning? He might have eaten some... Did well, he eat something raw? There's plenty of potatoes, so... I don't know, maybe he ate something raw. <laughs> I don't know. Fantastic. Okay. And he's vomiting on the medicine. That's just... Yeah. Quaint. He's vomiting in the food storage area. <sighs> Todd. Todd, Todd walked right by it. Poor guy. People are just being sick all, all over the garden. Oh, you people. Somebody did. Take your beer away. <laughs> you can't hold it. Good night. Look at all that. No more beer for now. Oh, shame on you guys. <laughs> oh. uh, look at that. Oh, Harry. What no. is his problem? He needs to eat. There's plenty of food. What is going on? What's... He has food, food poisoning. poisoning. Who's, who is poisoning all of his friends? I think what happened was he ate some raw food. But this is the second one. Or was this the same guy? Maybe he just can't hold his liquor very well. But food poisoning? Yeah. He must have eaten some some raw food, which doesn't make any sense because there's plenty there's of meals plenty around of here. plenty of meals. There are... I think everything in the freezer is good. There's nothing going bad. He's just got a sensitive stomach, I guess. Is he the one that's like super hyper sensitive to everything? Hypersensitive. Yeah. Psychologically hypersensitive. Yep, that's why then apparently he's just Plus going 80 to... Plus 80% of sensitivity. So what is he so stressed about? He's got the plants. He's just wired that way. Did he just fall on the plants? Oh, he's, he's planting them. Okay. Yeah. He's just wired that way. Poor guy. See now, closet. they're not pulling the food in here typically. They're leaving it in there, and I'm wondering if we need to like tell them to prioritize hauling here a little bit more. But we've got plenty of ones for hauling. Um, I mean, Marshall's mining to bits, and Jay is cooking apparently above. Hauling. I would appreciate Marshall to do some hauling. I think, and I think if we bump up a few of these things like um, we got a bunch of fours here so if we bump this up to a four I think I got to figure out this four figure bump out. all these up to fours okay. bump this up to a three mm -hmm. bump this up to a two and that won't change anything other than making him haul stuff okay her oh Marshall Marshall yeah we met Walter um, Jay could Jay. also doesn't Jay doesn't have a three listed, but he cooking. does cooking and then he does hauling, so he should be doing some hauling. Mm -hmm. um, I don't want to mess with that any. Nope. Um, Walter. How's just... Coffee doing? He's is he just hunting and oh, is he just plant cutting out there? What's he's he got plant going cutting, crafting. He's probably doing some. No, I don't look. He's doing any cooking. It's just he's okay. crafting. He'll he'll go craft. So he's probably doing some. Making stones most of the time is probably what he's oh, doing. Okay. So they're fairly well balanced. We just need some of that food hauled out of there. So I think that'll probably 
Nobody has well, a priority one you've, hauling. So. You've got them not using any meat except for, uh, is it Todd? Who's making fine meals. But he's around there doing other stuff. So too many people are cooking, so he can't use the meat. Yeah. Um, and they're also, they're not, they're leaving it in the area over there, so. Mm -hmm. Can you just combine the whole area? We could probably, we could probably turn one of them off of the simple meals and see if he'll. Could be. If he'll just do, but then he won't do anything else. He'll do cooking all the time. One of those things, he, he's going to do cooking occasionally. Just Right. Of course, if we have lots of good meals, he'll stop doing the good he'll meals. Yeah. So let's put a limit. Okay, that's a good idea. Let's put a limit on how many good meals he can do. Mm -hmm. Allow him, yeah. put one of them only for him to use. So he'll cook a bunch of good meals. Then be done. Then be done. Go do something else. Hopefully. Right. Um, but I also wanted to change Harry here. Let's make Harry... Um, he doesn't have any three, so if I bump up... Is growing to a two. Bump his two up to a three. Yeah. That means he'll go haul the stuff out of there first, and then he'll go check out what's left. So hopefully that'll work. He's cooking first. You know that, right? Yeah, that's okay. All right. Just checking. We have enough cooks that some that the cooking stoves are going to be busy. So yeah, let's do it like you said and put... Like I said? <laughs> I don't remember what... The oh, Which said. stove do you think we should put as the... Um, <sighs> Extreme meals only. <clears throat> um, let's sure. put it as the close one. All right. Oh my goodness! People so stay out of the freezer. Let's suspend the simple meals so they can only make fine meals on this. All right. So Todd will be the only one able to. And you have him doing that forever. You only want oh, to yes. do it for so many. Thank you. Um, let's go for like ten. That sound good. All right. Um, why it's don't actually, I recognize this? It's oh, do forever. Because I want to not do forever I want to do do until you have let's just say 10 okay so that's enough that everybody can have one mm -hmm. good meal a day and they can have some simple meals too all right we'll see how that works go <laughs> yeah Todd thank you poor old guy he's like I'm used to this I was a bartender <laughs> Look at him, he's just he's running just around. He's just running around. Cleaning and... everything up. He's like, eh, not a problem. I got it. My buddy. There he goes. He's going to make a good meal there. Excellent. And Jay's was hauling some food out of there, so that's good. Yep, look, we got all was... that food. Harry and Jay and Marshall and all got it all And we now have out. colored lights for decorative purposes. Which, you know. Ooh, ooh colored lights. Oh, we could also put in some. That. We forgot we could do some carpets too, huh? Yes, we could. We have cotton. Um, I'm just going to start on the simplest. No, I'm going to leave the shipbuilding because I don't care about the shipbuilding yet. Let's do the simplest of the others. Okay. Save the shipbuilding for last because once we undo that one, there'll be like three or four more other ones. 10% food. Wait. Nutrient paste dispensers consume 10% less food per meal produced. Then they don't like them, but they're good. They're very efficient meals. Okay. They don't taste very good, though. Yeah. So we, we won't even use it, but. We yeah, might get the research done. Nutrient paste reminds me of a certain movie from a movie series back in the day, which I don't know if I'm supposed to mention names, so I won't. But <laughs> where they had the oh the, the the gloop that they ate in the real world. Oh, from the Matrix. Yeah, oh, that's fine. <laughs> oh, okay. And there looks like Rexo and Legwa are having fun mining over there in the corner, and. We were going to have one extra bedroom in case of need, and we do have that plan for the hydroponics bay thingy um, area that we've mapped out. Haven't quite got it to where we think we need it yet, but we do have it in the plans. Eventually we can build a machining table, but we don't have anything to machine, so I think we're... And I'm not complaining, because machining usually, well, oh, what I know of it is that you can take things apart that attack you, but... We're assembling and disassembling machine components like mechanoid bodies and ammunition. Yeah. Oh. Hundred percent flammability. Thanks. We could actually put one in here somewhere. Like right yes, there. Yes, we could. Let's go ahead and just build one for the future. Okay. And that way we've got everything out there. Not turn it on or anything. So we never did. Do we ever actually look at that envelope? 
Nope, we didn't. It's Todd's chronological birthday today. Biologically, he's 20 years old. Chronologically, he just turned 720. <laughs> Note that since people that don't age while in crypto sleep, chronological birthday is separate from biological birthday. Obviously. So he's 20 years old. Or, you know, 720, 720 whatever you want to call it. Happy birthday. Yeah. <laughs> Happy birthday, Todd. He's taking a nap. Let's wake you up. If you, if you have a beer. Go have a beer. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's gonna join him for a beer. Yeah. Celebrate for his birthday. <laughs> oh my! Beers for everyone. Good grief! Or at least everyone who's fast enough. And he's and he's he's already making meals because he didn't go back to bed. He's like, mm, might as well. Huh? I'm happy. I'm good. Well. Yeah, he's gonna make some fine meals now, so that's good. And they're being eaten as fast as he's making them. Yeah, that's what I'm worried about. Is it? not going to be able to keep up with it, but... To, yeah. You could put them as don't eat for now or something. Uh, that'd be too hard to work with, though. Well, so is this. As long as people stop throwing up, I'll be good. Maybe if they're eating fine meals, they'll stop throwing up. Uh, could be, too. Yeah, somebody doesn't know how to cook. That's probably what was happening. Is that possible? I still can't figure out how they would have ended up with food poisoning. Yeah, I don't know. Okay. They ate raw food for some reason, and it didn't make it sense to me either, so, I don't know. We, we are almost done with this stuff. Wow, it is just cruising along here. That's because we have the master researcher. I feel like I'm forgetting something that I wanted to do, but I can't remember what it was, so... Well, all I know is, besides that we were going to build the electric plant thingy, whatever, I don't remember what they call those. Oh yeah, did somebody mine that? Nope. Nope, they didn't mine it yet. That's alright. Is that in the plan, or is that actually marked to, to mine? <laughs> Did I only mark it to plan and not mine? No, I put it to mine. Oh, okay. the, the thing is that we've got other mining down here. Right. Like, if we tell who's our, who's our top miner, our top miner is probably Marshall. Yeah. Virginia. If we tell Marshall, where you at, Marshall? He's gonna, no. Let's go, let's, sure, let's go tell him to do it. Alright. Get out there. Go up there and clean it up, and then we can actually start get constructing it. So that'll be good. Oh, okay. It's like a day trek just to get out there. Yeah. Just to marble water. Just to mine. There we go! We did it! Oh, look, and there's metal there. Yeah, I'm not going to worry about the metal at the moment. Um, we can mine in there if we want to later, but. Okay. We've got plenty of metal down below. So tell them to do that, and. find a good path along here to hook up to. Probably just... Well, we have the the line that goes straight out by the turrets. Yeah, I think this oh, is... I, I think we'll goes. just... I'm going to get rid of that power switch there. You need to move it here or just yeah. turn this off and on manually. Um, There's really no reason to have it on at all at the moment. Just hold on to mine out that little block there, too. It's kind of okay. silly to... And that block. <laughs> Um, let's just... Where are we gonna go? Like, great. I am not sure what you're doing. I'm trying to keep near the side without making it too monotonous. Okay. Like this? Like that? Yep. Don't mind us. We're just gonna take 20 minutes. <laughs> oh, right across here. That'll connect it up. We'll cancel that. Let's hold mine this out. Okay. Oh. Yeah, he's even carrying back some metal. Oh, Good job, buddy, but... Drop it. Um, don't forget to reconnect that electric spot where you... Yes. I was trying to do multiple things. I'm not getting anything done. Tell him to mine this one, too. Oh, but he wants to carry it to the end. We'll, we'll let him finish. We'll tell him to go back and finish it. <laughs> he's doing such a good job. He's our, he's our master worker today. <laughs> oh, Walter's working on... gosh. There's trees in the way. Ah, okay. Do they automatically remove the trees when there's something in the way? Yeah, when they need to make some. Oh, nice. Oh, hello. Uh, yay. Artist Desert really like us, and they're passing by. Yep, they are. And I think this is a good time as any to call it for this episode. All right, call it. So, thanks for watching, everybody. We hope you enjoyed... 
And this is Phoenix, signing off for Veil Pursuit. If you did enjoy, please let us know in the comments, and be sure to uh, subscribe for future content. And look, they actually planted those flowers that we wanted oh, to yeah, plant. Oh yeah, I noticed they're all like, pretty and stuff. Ooh, a beauty of 14, and a beauty of... Sorry, I gotta look real quick. 24! Oh, mm. apparently Daylily's a lot more beautiful. Okay, good to know. <laughs> so, we will see you in the next one. Now get on with your pursuit.